Hey everyone, welcome to Fuel. Uh, today we're just going to be taking a bit of a trip, uh, and I'm going to be kind of talking over it. I'm sorry, uh, there's going to be cuts when I cough, but first and foremost, uh, I want to just say I'm sorry for last week's episode of Sunday Drive being late. Uh, don't expect that kind of shit from me in the future on content, I promise. Um, and I'm sorry this week's episode is going to be uh, non-existent. Um, I'm, I'm sad to say it, but uh, there's varying degrees of setup for everything I do for Sunday Drive, and a lot of games don't have wheel support. Even if they're AAA games, there's just not the support for it, sadly. Um, I was going to play Need for Speed Rivals. It's a pretty decent game, um, apart from just the lacking usual EA shit they leave out. Um, but there's zero wheel support. I would, uh, there's control, uh, Xbox 360 controller emulation, which is fantastic if I bought the extra peripheral for it. Um, but I don't, so I'd have to emulate a controller to my wheel, which is just, it doesn't work well with my wheel. It doesn't work well anyway. Um, it's not the best setup. But, uh, I just... I had family coming over that I hadn't seen in a while, and that just kind of took priority. Saying, you know, why am I doing this? Why am I putting the effort in? I, I, I appreciate all my views and every fan that I've built, and anyone that is a fan of the Sunday Drive series, or even the Saboteur series, you know, thank you. Thank you for watching it. I appreciate every one of the fans. I know there are people other than me and my family that watch it. You know, my friends that I share the video with, actual people. I haven't met you, but you enjoy my content. You know, that's amazing. That's why I do this YouTube thing. But the amount of effort I'm putting into these series is not worth the result. The I want to do these series justice. And if I just keep banging out Sunday drives every week with what we have now, by the time I do have an audience to, you know, build a community and have it and have a discussion on this and stuff, I'm not going to have the best content for you. So, for the meantime, I'm cancelling Sunday Drive and cancelling the Saboteur until we have a bigger community that I think can appreciate it a lot more. If you're a major fan of Sunday Drive and you think this is a mistake, oh fuck. Okay. Um, tell me. I'll bring it back. I'll put the effort down. That's what matters to me is if the, you guys really enjoy it, I'll make it. There's no reason for me not to. But with the amount of audience retention and interaction that I have, I don't see it happening, so that's why I'm making this decision without really making a video asking for permission. Um, on the flip side, I'm going to be doing highlight videos. Shorter clips. I knew I was going to hit that. Short clips of uh, videos and stuff of the highlights of the best moments of this and that and um, just to try and build an eye so I can make exciting video titles and stuff people actually search because no one really searches for the saboteur playthrough anymore they should if they haven't seen it because it's going to be an amazing game trust me it's an amazing game but no one's searching it and I need to build an audience so that you guys can trust me that my content is good and we can go from there because without that I'm just pissing in the wind you know no one I'm giving it all I got and it's only really coming back to me and splashing a bit on you guys and I'm sorry that is a horrible horrible metaphor but that's what's up Oh man, I'm sorry this announcement didn't come sooner, that it's obviously pretty late for you guys, for me to be telling you that Sunday Drive isn't here and why it's not here, but um, the, the death of Robin Williams affected me and my family quite a bit. Uh, my parents grew up with Mork and Mindy and seeing Robin Williams on TV and stuff all the time. He, you know, his comedy and his, the acts and stuff that he did were legendary. He's, the humor in his movies, we grew up on, I grew up on, 
Mrs. Doefire and Flubber and Jumanji. I s still have Jumanji on VHS in my house somewhere. I'm sure we have Mrs. Doefire too. Probably damn near worn out how many times we've seen that movie. And I was just not in the right mind to record. I'm still iffy if I should release this for how depressing it's probably going to sound, but you gotta do what you gotta do. And I want to take care of you guys, or you know, at least have you guys know what's been going on with the channel and where's it going. And uh, without rambling on and making this a video that no one's gonna watch, uh, that's it. Uh, to summarize, and I'll put a link to this right now for everyone else who didn't want to sit through it. Uh, hey, this is the summary. Sunday Drive is cancelled unless there's a strong audience pull for it to come back. The Saboteur is cancelled for the same reason. Uh, um, and my channel will be switching to shorter highlight videos to try and build an audience and a community on titles that I can honestly name cool and awesome and you know all the stuff people search without you know just blowing smoke up your ass. I want to try and make good content, but it's going to be short. I'm not going to sit through series anymore. I um, mean, it's going to be sporadic, but it should be more or less regular. I should hopefully get two to three episodes out a week of just shows. So, that's that. Uh, rest in peace, Robert Williams. I am shattered that you're gone. My family is just broken. We don't want to, we can't watch it on the news. I mean, you're you're gone. That's that's it. My dreams of ever meeting you here on Vancouver Island or Salt Spring Island are gone, and it hurts. So that's uh, that's it for the for the series. Thank you, everyone who supported Sunday Drive and watched it, and brought a smile ear to ear when I saw how many views this show can get. And I'll happily bring it back if you guys make a voice and say you want it back. Until then, cheers, and as usual, form your own opinion.